Hey everyone, welcome to K News 24-7. My name is Cameron. Here, I'm giving you latest case Chiefs news update. This month, on the 13th, we are playing against TS Galaxy. Our coach Kevin Johnson confirmed that we have some players who won't be available because of injuries. The first player is Tadoyone Ditrokwe. He is not available because of an injury. He got injured on the first half of the season before uh, we, we go to AFCON. Tadoyone was injured. He got injured on his international duty with Botswana. So now he won't be available. But uh, it is not a big blow because we do have some replacements. Remember. Dovet Milsen can play as a foreign five and good news about Dovet Milsen, he just returned uh, to training from Ivory Coast as uh, he was also part and parcel of the AFCON with his national team Mozambique and now he is back in South Africa training with uh, the Glamour Boys. We also have a new player. Let me, yeah, I can say it's a new player because ever since Keiza Chiefs signed Uluk Flesh, uh, I think close to three months without playing even today. He, he even made his first debut into the club. He's also a center back. He can play good left, now good right. So he can be also a replacement for Tatoyone de Clock. We signed Uluk Flez injured on Super Sport United. So I, I believe Oguti Flez is also good, capable as uh, once Kevin, uh, Kevin Hunt uh, once stated that uh, it was not his plans or to look flesh a harm because of passport united they negotiated the deal of look flesh uh, while he was not available that's why flesh he now is now at case achieves according to Kevin hunt he will never let look flesh leave so it shows a good flesh is good quality but so one i look lala for a case achieves and then another player that is injured is George Matlo, but it's not a big blow also. Matlo Nai has been months uh, he was injured. He just played, I think we were playing against Sundowns if I'm not mistaken. So it's been a while since I have Matlo in the field. Now Konai just played less than five matches for 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 Ikeza Chiefs. Yeah, now we've seen Ii Lento Lena talent. We've seen what he's capable, but because of it, because of injuries, he can't. He can't. But let's hope what he, uh, he will recover faster and return back to the field. But on that position, which is attacking midfield, we have a lot of options. We have Ntutuzi Shabalala who can play there. Nkosini Pile Ngobo who just uh, got a new deal two years. Uh, he's also in attacking midfield. Kigen Doli can play. Uh, Botsane maybe but Botsane is a winger a, a right winger but I think even on the attacking midfield he can play if we, we have no choice we are stranded he can also play so we have a lot of players uh, including Abum Tutuzim Tanzan and remember we also promoted Umfundo Villagas I just pray uh, our coach Kevin Johnson can give Umfundo Villagas that chance to, to express to express himself Simbon Wuti Uspetelin because I think Mfundo is the last youngster we, we are relying on. Uh, we were once relying on Umtutuzi Shabalala. He got his chance Simbonile but thinking uh, that was a wrong timing. Um, to do the he is quality, but he came to Kaiser Chiefs uh, at the wrong time under uh, coach Arthur Zwane. Club, big mess, big mess. And Nayu Zwane, Bachesha Bamhambisa. So I think uh, players who got promoted uh, under uh, Arthur Zwane, they were not that fortunate enough. Even though Uzwane was using valid these players, especially um, to do the Shabalala. But these players, Tema Kambu Zwane, uh, chaos because they never uh, uh, tested Ilentole football from lab. Because Tema Fikunziki, he was not a, a, young, a young player's believer. Ogutama young players can, can play, they can compete, they can uh, revive the club. 
So he sidelined all these young stars until now uh, Sbona or Kevin Johnson coming into the club and then he shows interest uh, in young stars. So that's why Sbona Mfundo Villagazi uh, got a promotion. He is given a five-year deal to, to be with the club. So let's hope for the best. But I think this second half things will change. We'll see a lot of positivities. Maybe Nababo Gonzalez, uh, they will get their first goals because ever since I figured who oh, FMAM Jason Gonzalez, no goals, no nothing. But it remains to be seen. It will depend on the coach. As he opted not to sign any players, it means he definitely trusts these players. So they will give us something. So now uh, these players definitely even motivated into a good sign or anyone because uh, it gives them a lento lena or good by a tembega. Like if the coach is relying on you guys, what are you going? What are you guys going to do to say thank you to the coach? Because he's prepared to give everyone an opportunity. How good he is. So this is a chance. It's a chance for a coach to prove himself to EK's Chiefs management and also for the players to prove themselves. Would definitely be a beef up, it was not uh, necessary. But let's hope everything goes well. But the players they have a role to play, they need to fight themselves, they need to fight for every point uh, in this second half. We will start with the TS Galaxy, they owe us, they've beaten us. Uh, Several times it has galaxy. Baba's Valley Tuba look look lift the trophy the last time. Banging us to go the STV Premiership. So it has galaxy. We, we have unfinished business. We have to make sure to defeat them. But guys, uh, I think. Oh, I'm left with just a minute. I'm left with just a minute. But don't forget. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like the video. If you're a regular viewer on EK News 24 7, make sure that each and every time uh, you don't leave the video without liking it it is very important because my videos uh, get promoted to a wide uh, audience if you do that so i i appreciate a lot and also to comment guys it is very important i re i respond to almost more than 80 percent of my comments i definitely respond whether it's negative or positive i respond because I care about you guys. I care about you. But uh, this is it. This is it. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, so Pindas Bonan next time with something.